At least 31 million people are at risk for severe weather across the southeast and the Gulf Coast today in a rare string of summer storms. Yeah, these storms could bring a few strong tornadoes, massive hail, and damaging wind gusts of at least 80 miles an hour. Let's head over to NBC News meteorologist Bill Karens with the latest. Hey, Bill, so this kind of weather, it's pretty unusual for this region this time of year, right? Yeah, very unusual, especially for a high wind event in the deep south. First off, let me show you, New York City is being swallowed up by heavy rain, maybe some small hail and a thunderstorm. This is a shot from our building looking south, the Empire State Building. You can't even see lower Manhattan. Let me reverse this, actually. Let me show you the shot from the Empire State Building, looking at us, we're in this building right here, the Comcast Building, and you can see the dark clouds rolling north up there towards the Bronx. So let's get back to the weather maps and show you the areas of greatest concern today. So we already have thunderstorms that are breaking out. We've had one report of a tornado right along the border here of Alabama and Georgia. So far, 18 high wind reports. By the time we're done today, I wouldn't doubt if that number is like over 200. So here's our current watches. Tornado watches, Birmingham to Montgomery. Also a tornado watch here for the southern portion of Georgia, the southwest corner. And then severe thunderstorm watch continues around Starkville. We have one big thunderstorm just heading just south of Texarkana and north of Shreveport. That uh, thunderstorm watch is until 5 p.m. So a uh, zoomed in look at some of the worst storms. You notice we have tornado warnings here. You can kind of see a little hook on these storms too. That's by Headland here in areas of Alabama and these will be heading into Georgia. So again, this is where that one tornado was reported. So the atmosphere is favorable for some strong storms in that region. In all, as we mentioned, over 30 million people at risk. It's very unusual to have a moderate risk of severe weather. That means in this area, from Monroe to Jackson, north of Hattiesburg to Montgomery, we can expect strong storms and definitely a lot of wind damage. Isolated strong tornadoes are also possible this afternoon as we're going to watch this line of storms racing through the southeast. So, uh, yeah, we have to be prepared, uh, lose power, and also the chance of some damage. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.